Hi there, Stacy Harding with Hourglass Consulting Group. Say, as a business and life coach and working with people over the course of almost four decades uh, about their business and their goals and their lives, I've often taught courses on life planning and how people can get the most out of their lives. And one of the parts of that process is to stop and ask people if they have any regrets in their life. And so I want to pose it to you a little bit differently today. So I would ask you this question. Have you considered if you were to die today, what regrets, if any, you would have? So I want to pause for just a moment. It'll only be a few seconds for you to think about that. If you were to die today, would you have any regrets? So hopefully you've had some thoughts on that. And some of you may say, absolutely not. I wouldn't change a thing in my life today or in the future. Others of us may be thinking about regrets from our past, and that is very common. Others of us may be thinking about things we would miss in the future if we were to not get another day beyond today. And I think it tells us a lot about our mindset of whether we think we would have regrets of, of our past, whether those are failures or experiences or hardships, certainly they're real. Or the things that we would miss not enjoying or experiencing, maybe our family and watching them grow and have life, etc. With either of those cases, what it causes us to do is to think about something other than being present. And if you really think through it, we never have the past again. We never have the future. We actually just have now. And so if we're blessed to wake up again tomorrow and have another day, it's the present. And so I think a lot of suffering in this world comes from regrets from the past or worry about the future instead of living for the moment. And when I say that, I don't mean you don't have goals and you don't have ambitions and you don't plan. Of course we do. We, uh, we are driven to grow and experience in our life. And, and quite frankly, if we ever stop that, it will become a very small world for us. But for today, I hope you can just think about being present in the gift of life that you have without regret. Find peace, find freedom in that, and find happiness and enjoy your life. If this is the kind of thing that you would like to learn more about, um, I'm a coach. I hope you'll reach out to me. I'll talk with you. And if it leads to an opportunity for us to work together, great. If not, I'd love to have the, the opportunity for the conversation. So I wish you the best today. Enjoy your life. Thanks so much.